Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. New tech begins here. And in this video, we are going to enable the OpenCL GPU acceleration Mercury playback engine in Premiere CS6 on a Mac. So let me show you how it looks the first time when you start Premiere, let's take an untitled project. So what you want to do, you want to go ahead and go to project, project settings and general. And here, as you can see, we have a renderer, which is the software only renderer. It says renderer Mercury playback engine software only. So normally here you have to activate the second choice, which is with hardware or open CL engine. So how are we going to do that? Without further ado, let's begin. So we close Premiere eh? and what you want to do, you want to go to finder and then what you want to do you want to click on premiere and here comes the tricky part right click on cs6 show package contents then you want to go ahead and go to contents and here again right click on gpu sniffer and then you want to go to show package contents go to contents go to mac os and here you want to double click on gpu sniffer all right so as you can see here it will give you this screen with a gpu computation information and the important line for you is where it says name. So what you're going to do, you want to go ahead and select the name of your graphics card. In this case, it's the ATI Radeon HD Hawaii Pro prototype compute engine. So you want to copy that. Right click and copy. And then we're going to go ahead and close this window. Then we want to go back. If you have an ATI card, you want to go to this file here, which is the case. We need to modify this file here, OpenCL supported cards. If you have, if you happen to have an NVIDIA card, you want to go ahead and modify this line here. So here we have a ATI card, so we want to stay with OpenCL want to go back first go back again so we go to this file here right click on it open with and here you want to choose your favorite text browser I'm using text wrangler click on that all right so once we are in here you want to go ahead and modify the file just press enter once. You do not currently have write permission for OpenCL supported cards. Do you want to make it writable? Yes, make it writable. And here you want to go ahead and right click and paste. And as you can see, now we have ATI Radeon HD Hawaii Pro Compute Prototype Compute Engine, which is our card. You want to go ahead and save it just by going to file save enter your extremely secure password again all right and now as we can see if we close this window here we enlarge it a little bit we can see that we have now also ET Radeon HD Hawaii Pro prototype compute engine all right, so you want to go ahead and close this window. And what we want to do now is to reboot the system. 
So let's reboot. So All right, guys. So after having done the reboot, I'm going to go ahead and start again Adobe CS6. And we're going to go ahead and go to an untitled project. And then we want to go to project. You want to go to project settings in general. And now, as you can see, we not only have Mercury Playback Engine software only, but we also have Mercury Playback Engine GPU Acceleration OpenCL. So now it uses the full potential of your graphics card, which is really nice and which makes the rendering time much faster when you render your video. That concludes this video for today. I hope that it was helpful for you. If it was, hit that like button. And I would like to thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. I will see you in my next videos. Have a nice day and adios. Baby, but you know